Welcome back, LHS. I'm Emma. And I'm Jack Quees. And this is your Blue, Blue Devil, Devil News. News. This year's spring musical is Beauty and the Beats. Auditions are November 28th and 29th. See Miss Fitzgerald in the choir room or Mr. Raglan in the theater room for more information. Audition materials will be available soon. This Saturday, November 5th, is the annual FBLA Princess Party. Tickets are $5 per person, so a parent and child will cost $10. Tickets can be purchased online through the link Miss Buchanan sent out. There's a pep rally scheduled for this Friday to prepare our football team's first game of the playoffs. HOSA will be selling socks to raise money for prosthetic legs in underdeveloped countries. More information on how to buy the socks is coming. The LHS food drive starts Monday the 7th and runs through Friday the 18th. We'd like to wish a happy birthday to Mr. Curry. And a quick reminder, Cafe Blue is closed this week. Now let's check in with Charlie Mae for the weather. Thanks, guys. Today is 59 degrees and sunny with a high of 72 and a low of 51. The wind is 2 miles per hour, and tomorrow it'll be sunny with a high of 75 and a low of 46. Back to y'all. Thanks, Charlie Mae. In local news, there is a new restaurant coming to town that's similar to The Goat. Since it's still in the early process, there is not a final location, but there are many to be considered. The new building for Stoner Creek Elementary School in Mount Juliet is scheduled to open after Thanksgiving. The old building was destroyed in the tornado back in 2020. According to Wilson County Schools spokesperson Bart Baker, there will be a gradual move in, pro in process throughout November. Now back to Charlie May with sports. Thanks, y'all. This Friday, the football team will host the Riverdale Warriors for the first round of the playoffs. The game starts at 6.59, and the student section theme is pajamas. The Philadelphia Phillies took, took game three of the World Series last night in a dominant 7-0 game. The Phillies have five home runs from five different batters. There is even a speculation that the Astros pitcher had been tipping the, his pitches, accidentally letting the Phillies batters know what pitch he was throwing. The Game 4 is scheduled for tonight at 7 p.m. on Fox. The NFL trade deadline was yesterday at 4 p.m. Eastern. The teams were able to get several big trades on the books before time ran out. Notably, Bradley Chubb and Jeff Wilson are on their way to Miami. Chase Claypool is now a Chicago Bear. And suspended Atlanta receiver Calvin Wrigley has been traded to the Jaguars. Tonight, the Memphis Grizzlies take on the 5-1 Portland Trailbla Trailblazers. Tip-off is at 9 p.m. And tomorrow's night's Thursday football game features the undefeated Philadelphia Eagles against the 1-5-1 Houston Texans. As, as of right now, the Eagles are favored by 14 points. And the Vols are the number one team in the college playoff rankings. That's all the sports I have. Back to y'all. Thanks, Charlie May. That's all we have today for you, LHS. I'm Evan. And I'm Emma. And this has been the news to you from, from the, the White and Blue. Blue. Welcome back to Wrestle Wednesdays. I'm your host, the American Yankster, Gabe Cripps. From Monday Night Raw, the OC, he, Luke Gallows, Carl Anson, and AJ Styles. I've got a real Ripley problem. And we have new WWE Women's Tag Team Champions. They are Asuka and Alexa Bliss. From NXT, we celebrate Mandy Rose's year-long 365-day reign as NXT Women's Champion. From AEW, Orange Cassidy's the all at championship. Big claps. From Friday Night Smackdown. Not the new or Ted table. That's a piece of garbage. And the pay per view for this one is Crowd Jewel. And probably Survivor Series. Who knows? On Crowd Jewel. November 5th in Saudi Arabia. It'll be the Monster Among Monsters, Braun Strowman from Friday Night Smackdown versus the Nigerian Giant from Monday Night Raw, Omos. And. Probably in the main event, who knows? 
Who knows what W to be? It will be Roman Reigns versus versus YouTube Bones Megastar Logan Paul, and then a whole lot of big matches such as a steel cage match against Drew McIntyre and Karrion Cross. Last woman standing match. Then we have Brock the Beast in Carniff. Brock Lesnar versus the Almighty Bobby Lashley. And then we got the OC versus Judgment Day. I guess that's it. So we'll see you guys next week on Wrestling Wednesdays. Peace.